Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new series of Let's Play Travian here on Angliosphere Server 2. Um, I thought I'd just make a start of a series. I'm not sure if it will be uploaded or when it will because this is quite a serious server for us. Um, at the moment it's currently day 10. It's one of the new ones with the new general tab which I really like. So at the moment we're rank 95 in population, resource rank 48 a day, 112 so far, military strength not really anything because we haven't got many troops, but culture points 71 per day and 32 so far. So we've got a second village which is a 150% 15c out quite far away minus 175 11 as you can see here. Um, settled this a couple of days ago, starting on level 6s now. Um, the reason we've done this is we're planning to make a um, large Roman World Wonder Killer hammer. Um, so that'll be quite interesting to see. Um, when I was talking about culture points earlier, when we sent the settlers off, we were rank 12th for culture points so far. So we're in the top top to send our settlers off, and that was without a gladiator helmet, without any raiding without any party in we just um got a really good strategy going for early culture points going so if you look at the village here we've got lots of level nine and seven crannies here got the embassy up we've got the academy up main building marketplace all of this was for culture points um i might potentially make a video about how to settle fast without raiding on a 1x server but it was um a lot of work i've got a jewel on this server as well but at the moment we're doing a little bit of micro raiding. We've got 40 legionnaires uh, bringing in. I think we've raided about 20,000 so far this week. Yeah, 22,000. Which for 40 legionnaires isn't too bad. It's breaking even. And it's just bringing a bit of extra resources in. So our plan for now is to keep upgrading these fields to level 7, level 8. And then start focusing on parties. And over here in our cropper we're shipping as much resources as we can building up the croplands, NPC and building more croplands, so we're just going to build this as fast as we can. Um, we're here with an alliance, uh, this is the wing at the moment, we're going to be moving into the main one, I'll probably show that more in another video. Um, I won't be uploading this anytime soon though, because um, I don't want people to see what we're doing on the account, but um, hope you look forward to watching the series, and I'll catch you in the next update. Hi guys and welcome back to the next update. Sorry it's been a while, I've had um, exams and I've been ill. So it's now day 32 with 3,000 here people playing. Uh, we've got currently ranked 31 in population, 19 per day in resources, 17 so far. And then culture points we are 29 per day and 30th so far. So it's been quite a while so it's going to be a massive jump from the last video. So we've got all level 13s here and we're just getting up our Heroes Mansion to level 20 to take our final oasis. So we're hoping that will push us into the top five of resources per day. We settled two more villages. So we've gone for this one here. We've hardly used any gold building this up. It's just been me and my jewel pushing resources in, simming slowly. We golded one of these each up, and that's about it really. Got all to eight normally, just simming. And I mean, in inside it's not looking too massive at the moment. We're just slowly building up the infrastructure. We're going to start building culture point building soon. Get parties going on in here. Um, this attack here is just a random noob attacking us with no troops, so we're just going to ship resources away. But we settled a 9 cropper, and the reason we settled this one is because we've got a, another 50% oasis here. So this one will be for our capital, this one will be for us, and then a 25, 25 iron wheat one there. Um, over in the spawn village, we've got maxed out all the fields now. And in here we've just been building up culture point building. So we've got the main building 20, market 20. Academy will be going to 20. We're just getting Town Hall up a little bit as well. And we've got one left on the bakery, and that'll be us max resources. Um, what we're doing, we're shipping all spare resources either into our capital or into our alliance bonuses. Um, so, with our alliance, we've joined the main wing, Justice for Harambe, 59 players in here. Got a couple of really good players. I don't know any of them personally, but Jewel has um, played with them before. And so far we're doing quite well on the Alliance bonuses as well. So I've got them all open. So we've got already got 2% in the Commerce, Philosophy and Recruitment. And the um, Armour bonus one, sorry I don't know how to say that, is um, going up soon as well. So that's the update for now. I'll probably do another one later. Um, 
because it's a 1x server and there's not much going on because we've simmed out it's quite slow so I'll probably just do a quick update every couple of days just to see how we're going, show us what the resource ranks like, how the capital's looking and when we start building our troops that's when I'll probably start making more and we'll be doing raiding and that and such. Um, but oh, I forgot to mention troops wise these are all from adventures we're just going to use them to help clear oasis these we've built but they're defending other people at the moment we've just been pushing culture points we haven't been making troops going to get some more scouts up at some point and then culture points we've on almost 1400 a day and we're doing small parties in both these two villages and once our zero one gets some more culture points then we'll start partying there so yeah that's the update for now i'll um, see you in the next bit Hi guys and welcome back. So it's been five days since my last update, um, 37, and in these past five days we have grown so, so much. If we go down, we're up at rank 20 for population now. Resources per day, rank 6, so far 17. Uh, troops, not so much really, but culture points as well, rank 16th and 20th so far. So, since the last thing I've done, we got our final oasis and all to 14, so we're just going to start on level 15s now. Um, so yeah, Heroes Mansion down here as well, 150% 15 cropper, and now we're just going to keep on smashing this up. We want to get to level 17s and maybe level 18s before artifacts. Um, culture points as well, absolutely smashing it out. So, in these three villages here, we've got Great Party great party and great party because we're doing 2000 culture points a day um, soon in 02 we're going to push up another level 10 and do great parties in there and just keep simming settling as many villages as we can uh, so in 01 now completely finished the tiles got a couple more levels on the bakery but we're just getting up all the rest of the infrastructure now we've got a oasis in it and we'll probably get up oh, someone's on we've got an oasis in Zero one, and we'll probably go for a second one soon. Zero two, which is our nine cropper, we've started getting one of each to ten. These will go into nines and then tens, and then we're going to work on getting the wheat fields and get that 50% oasis I was talking about. Zero three, we settled yesterday. We've just been simming up slowly. Uh, we're not really using gold in it at all, so we're just using the uh, watching adverts to get 25% faster. And our spawn as well, uh, not looking much different. We've got some more troops in it now. Still need to get the bakery level up, but we're f focusing on grand parties. Uh, Troops-wise, we've just built some Praetorians. We've got 20 scouts in there as well, but we're going to start using these for alliance defense. And uh, speaking of the alliance, the bonuses are going really quite well at the moment. So we've hit recruitment, the armor and bonus one, and the commerce, and we've all we're about just under a million resources away from hitting plus eight percent culture points, which will be absolutely insane for simming. With all these uh, grand parties we're throwing, we're going to ha hope we just keep on getting parties going. Um, zero three, sorry, we keep keep getting villages just going out all the time. Zero three, we settled right above us because this is going to be our hammer village. We're going to sim this up quite well, and probably in about five to ten days or so, we're going to get the workshop to level twenty and start pumping up catapults 24-7. We don't need to worry about troops till about day 70, day 80. So we can run catapults in a level 20 workshop and keep getting our fields up. We're going to start getting some EIs in here soon as well. And I know we're quite far out. We're going to get a tournament square up, do some raiding, and the EIs will be used for clearing artifacts. So that's it. In the next one, I'll probably make an update um, if anything different happens or once we get all, leveled, all to level 15s.